106. 106 KMEL. It's 106 KMEL. Your girl Shay Diddy backstage with G Easy. What's going on, bruh? Everything. Wrapping up the tour at yeah. home. Mm-hmm. I feel hella good. You feel hella good? Yeah, yeah. Woke up this morning. I checked my phone. I had a text from E40. Uh, he said, call Unk. <laughs> <laughs> Which Man. means, uh, is E40 going to hit the stage tonight? Man, I I, I, I can't tell. What? I, I can't tell. It's all secrets. He's like, it's all But I got a few secrets up my sleeve, yeah. You always have secrets. You tend mm-hmm. to surprise, especially when you're at home. You turn up just a yeah. little bit more. I mean, yeah, like these shows are special. They always mean more. Not to say, like, every show, every city, I always, you know what I mean? Like, right. I would never take a night off. But, you know, when we come home, it's always a movie. It's always a movie. You got to turn mm-hmm. up just a little bit more. So, given that San Francisco is almost the last spot, because mm-hmm. I believe you have to go to Hawaii next. Yeah. Where you do, what are you doing? God, what a drag. We have to go to Hawaii. I know. <laughs> Get a tan for me. God, it's such a hard job. <laughs> What's coming up next? Uh, We do Hawaii, then we do Australia and New Zealand. Okay. And then uh, another tour in the States. And mm-hmm. then we do Europe. And then we got some plans for this summer, something big. What? What, what are these plans? Yeah. You feel me? <laughs> he said we soon. can't talk about Coming that. Soon. Can we get a little teaser? Coming soon. Okay. I was thinking, like, is G, are we going to see G-Eazy in more movies? Because I know you Man. got your acting debut. Yeah. I actually, I just had a meeting yesterday in L.A. with, yeah. like, a big movie producer. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, it's crazy. I, I had never acted before anywhere in life. Like, no, like, theater, high really? school, nothing. Like, okay. yeah. And uh, I just did this short film. I like the role. I like the the you know what I mean the story. Yeah. Um, we did it. We knocked it out in three days. It was like sixteen hour days on set, crazy. Right. And I really just like, I got the bug. Like I fell in love with like it was with that. You know what I mean? It was just different. Like you're so used to making music, and this you know what I mean it was almost like a different way of expressing yourself, a different right. world. Yeah. But it was cool. That's dope. So, what's this new movie that you might be doing that you met for in L.A.? Like, are you now trying to go after that a little bit more? Uh, no, nah, I mean, like, you know, everything happens for a reason. Okay. And, uh, I think, I mean, right now I'm, you know, we're touring for like the next six months okay. and then get to work on the next album. So everything in due time, but, uh, it's, it's something cool to, you know what I mean? To dabble in and start to get my feet wet. Well, I can definitely see it. See so you doing that, especially uh-huh. based on some of your videos. You're already acting yeah. whether you believe Leonardo it or not. Leonardo DiRaprio <laughs> coming to a theater near you. I hate you. You're so special. <laughs> now I know Keek the Sneak was in there with you. Within mm-hmm. the movie yeah. as well, right? How yeah. was that doing it with It Keek? was almost tough to act because I was so like trip. I'm starstruck. I'm like, this Keek, you know what I mean? And I'm trying to remember <laughs> the lines, like what to say. Right. Was, we had this conversation in the movie, and I'm like, wow, this Keek, you know what I mean? I'm trying not to sound nervous. Like, shit. <laughs> I grew up on bruh. Like, that's crazy. You know what's funny? I can see why they called you the hip hop cash prince in Forbes mm-hmm. because you're always on tour. And now yeah. you're venturing into acting. You're always getting your money, and it's yeah. like you're so humble about it, but you sell out shows everywhere you go. I mean, San mm-hmm. Francisco sold out in a day. Yeah. So how does that feel to be named Forbes Hip Hop Cash Prince? I mean, it's cool. It's it's. I mean, it's an honor. It's, you know, it's definitely amazing right. um, to be recognized by, obviously, Forbes. Yeah. Um, But I, it's just really like all I know is go. Yeah. I'm just a goer. That's the baby. You know, yeah. It is, we got to get it. You know, it's not going to get itself. Mm. So it's really just no days off and just maximizing, you know what I mean, opportunities, taking advantage of everything that's in front of us because I dreamed about this forever. Right. You know what I mean? Like years and years and years. And it's not, you don't just get these opportunities. It yeah. just doesn't happen. You right. know what I mean? To everybody. So it's like to have this window we have right now, you know, to have everything lining up. Mm-hmm. You know, the way it is with the new album doing well and like you got to strike while the iron's hot and get it while right. you can because, you know, you never know how long it'll last, if it'll be here tomorrow, That's whatever. Right. So you just got to just got to appreciate the blessings and just make the most of it. Speaking of the album, we know it did very well. Debut number five it on Billboard. It did very well, extremely, <laughs> extremely well. well. Um, As a matter of fact, it's blowing up all around the world. See what I'm talking about acting? <laughs> <laughs> Are we gonna get a new album from you soon? Or are you working yeah. on another project? What's yeah, going on I'm with the music? Yeah, we get back in the studio. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Have you been working with anybody, or you haven't had a chance to yet? I haven't had a chance to yet. Cause you're uh, yeah, I've been going and going and going. Basically, literally since the album dropped. Okay. Yeah. That's what's up. No days off. You know, I'm, we always looking for new music from you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Especially with me, myself, and I has 30 million views on YouTube. That's crazy. Does that ever trip you out? Like hell damn. yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, I remember just like, like when I was uploading songs to MySpace, 
when right. I was hella young. Damn, just like if you if you had a million plays on MySpace, like that was like damn, you were down there like you felt like you made it. Right. That you know what I mean? Like I remember refreshing my page, like, damn, I only got a thousand plays. You know what I mean? <laughs> like so a million felt you know what I mean, like the moon. Right. So to so to have like a Spotify it's over a hundred million. Right. The song. Jesus. So that's crazy. It's it almost doesn't even make sense. Right. I, I I think I might have just died somewhere and this is all just like heaven. This is all a dream. I don't know what's happening right now. That's the hustle. You deserve mm. it. We're definitely happy to see you and I cannot wait to see you hit the stage tonight. Hell yeah. Any last look at him. Any <laughs> last things that you want to say to the Bay Area that we should be expecting? Man, just, or? just love. Like thank you everybody who supported the movement. You know what I mean? This was obviously it started at home. Right. <clears throat> you know. But so it's always, you know, the Bay helped me down first. So, you know, it's it's been beautiful. Well, we definitely so thank you. Definitely appreciate you and everything you do. Keep representing yeah. for the Bay. Yeah, I'll talk. Girl Shay Diddy backstage with G Easy. It's 106 KML.